Oh, it's blue. Why wouldn't it be? Oh, um, go on. It you know, Obi-Wan, in all of this stuff we watch, you really don't come out looking too good. Well, I... You're arrogant. Your apprentices end up slaughtering younglings. Your hair in the Attack of the Claw, I mean... What even is that? This bad stuff is always happening. It's just everyone's got a camera phone now. I mean, when you no, my generation of Jedi were just better. Qui Gon, I've More just better. found a home video of a time when you were an apprentice. What? I burnt those. She thought you might do that, so Madame Jocasta knew kept a VHS oh. copy back. Ah! Pass the popcorn. Who's that? Oh no. OMG, it's Count Dooku, isn't it? Volume. Oh. Do we have to? <laughs> Look at that hair. Mullet curtains. That's the same haircut you have. Look at them eyebrows. Did you get your eyebrows threaded? No. We'll be arriving shortly, Master. Why don't you have an Irish accent? I picked it up when I was posted on Belfast 6. I'm well clear of the village. Tensions are high enough. Yes, Master. Tell you what, though. Those are some chiseled pecs. Oh, it's all inclined flies and intermittent fasting. I'll take a copy of your meal plan. That's one tired looking droid. Maybe don't give carrying hay bales to the spindly leg droid. Excuse me. Sorry to trouble you. No room at the inn, Virgin Qui Gon. It's part of the Jedi Code. Hmm. This droid that is covered in human feces might be a clue. Well, that wasn't a droid. So badly misuse your idol. Oh. Oh, it's Torturey McGee. And Buttmouth. Where are they holding the Senator's son? Why should we tell you? Hello there, Master Jedi. We'd like to take you on two versus two. Well, what weapons have you got? Well, he's got this rusty hook, and I've got this, it's like a metal toilet brush. Allow me to make my intentions clear. Slightly more even now. Jedi. We are here to help resolve the situation. For the Senator. Oh. Our hooks are no match for their skilled force powers and laser swords. What do you know, Senator Dagonet? He's French, probably. He is one of the longest standing senators in the Republic. Yes. And when you entered this village, you could see the effects of his long-standing policies. We'd seen someone who had taken a deuce in the urinal droid. That was a protest vote. With due respect, if you don't like him, why not elect a new senator? I wish it were that simple. Oh, Qui-Gon. Sweet, sweet Qui-Gon. What? You're so naive when it comes to politics. Well, how do you bring about change, Obi-Wan? Where I'm from, you can't get a bus read timetable without kidnapping a senator's son. Come. I will show you where the senator's son is. You're one of the kidnappers. <gasps> Buttmouth? Cock nose? You too? Even you ripped ears? Especially hench ears. He was listening out for intruders. They all are. So this planet has blast doors made of rotten wood. I did think that. Maybe get less rotting doors before you make them automatic. Have you been treated well? For a prisoner, yes. Besides, I have Tuton here to keep me company. <laughs> what do you want to do today, Tuton? Charge our ports and then move hay bales until bedtime? Beep boop. Your deal will soon be over. 
It's not much of an ordeal. Not compared to how these people are living. Bit of Stockholm Syndrome in their land. I mean, look at this guy. What kind of quality of life is that? He literally has to live with a butt for a mouth. He eats with that thing, like a maggot. How could my father allow this to happen to his people? You don't blame them for abducting you. What choice do they have? I think they should blow my brains out right now. I'm willing to sign something so this guy can have my mouth. The senator, he's here and he's brought soldiers. You have deceived us, Master Jedi. And now you shall feel the power of this fully operational blunt rusty hook. Oh, bollocksing heck. It's a bunch of guys in barber jackets. Just finished a fox hunt, Lions. Any for your thoughts, Kai? Honestly, I was still thinking about whether Teuton would actually be great company. He must have great chat, like R2. You serve the Senate. No, we serve the people of this Republic. And Table 9 has been waiting for over 40 minutes. Hey! Oh, it's blue. Why wouldn't it be? Oh, um, it's not really my place to tell. Go on. We'll watch Attack of the Clones after. It's probably best it doesn't come directly from me. No! Shredded ears! Cock nose. But mouth's long lost friend. Don't defy me. Not even you, Master Jedi. You know what? He was always for strangling people. Back then, we just thought it was normal. Galaxies moved on. You wouldn't get away with that as a Jedi nowadays. Be trending on Twitter before you could say salacious B. Crumb. Go, save your father. What? Go now. Oh, can't I finish this game of tic-tac-toe with Tuton? Corruption like yours <gasps> must be eradicated. False choking, vigilante executions without a trial. It just feels different when you judge it by today's standards. Father, how could you do this? These are your people. How could you let this happen to Buttmouth? How couldn't you nurture Teuton's burgeoning social skills? Your actions saved many lives today. Yeah, good work, I guess, Master. Maybe you can show me a bit more respect around here. Just thinking in the moment, Master. Well then. You're a much wiser man than I, Qui-Gon Jinn. And your pecs are firmer than a plate of Beskar armor. Oh, shut up. <laughs> oh, you love it. We've seen your Instagram. Thanks to your teachings. Though someone seems to be passing off ancient wisdom as their own words. It's just a saying. Are you saying that you never use that phrase with Anakin? I'd never in a million years, rip off someone else's poignant moment. Absolute poodoo. Anakin! Yes, Master? You're far more of a moron than I. I'm sorry for disappointing you, my Master. <laughs> You're such a bell Obi-Wan. Uh.